Paul, how you meet Jessica? On, on Yelp. On Yelp? <laughs> Yup, it's not dating app. Did you review a prostitution agency or something? On Yelp. Five stars. You got five stars? Nice, nice. This is nephew Paul and niece Jessica. The weirdest couple Uncle Roger met from my Haya tour in LA. Niece and nephew, we added some final date to Haya tour. Hit pause on screen now to see if I come into your city. All ticket link in description. If Uncle Roger not coming to your city, or ticket also out already, join Uncle Roger mailing list. Hopefully I add extra show there. Hope to see niece and nephew there. Because if you come, do what Paul and Jessica do. Wear orange polo and bring Uncle Roger favorite ingredient. You bring me some MSG. You bring me MSG for you. Look at this. Nice, nice. Where you get this from? Uh, it's actually from the fifties. From the fifty. And you still haven't finished. <laughs> it expired. <laughs> You're trying to poison me, hi. Uh, MSG from the 50s. Where you get this from, World War II? Uh, how you get this? How you get this? Estate sale. So some grandma died and then you steal her MSG. What is this? This is terrible thing to leave your grandchildren. You write for your grandchildren in your will. Five pound of MSG. It's so sad, but thank you. Uncle Roger don't want this shit, but thank you. <laughs> thank you. I uh, MSG from the 50s. Put it on your chicken wing, put the MSG on your chicken wing. Maybe later. Maybe later. Just put, just shit yourself, I don't care. Just shit yourself. I, uh, what you do for a living, Paul? What you do? Uh, I'm an eBay seller. Ebay seller, okay. What kind of stuff you sell? <laughs> Is it just expired MSG? <laughs> this guy not doing well on his Ebay shop. Go leave him one star rating, this guy. Okay, what kind of stuff you sell? Uh, vintage clothing, records, books. Vintage clothing, vintage book. Everything vintage about you? Yes. Even your MSG vintage, okay. You dress your shirt very vintage also. Which dead person house you steal that from? I don't remember. There's so many dead people. There's so many dead people. I, uh, why they put him in front row? You got here first. You got here first. Okay, okay. The people stuck there, they fucked up. See? Sorry, you come late. Piano blocking you. I'm not even gonna use this piano. I don't know why the fuck this shit here. Do you get sex toy from dead people? Sorry, children. Do you get sex toy? Yeah? yeah. Oh, what kind of sex toy you get from dead grandma? It wasn't supposed to be sex toy. It was supposed to be like a, like a quack therapy. A quack a butt therapy. Butt a butt plug. From the, from the 20s. From the 20s. <laughs> from the 20s. World War I butt plug. <laughs> and then you sell it on your eBay account? Yeah. Some lady in Australia bought a butt plug from the twenties. You you make a living doing this business. More than just butt plug, but yes. More than just butt plug. Have you used any on her? Have you found his stash of dead people sex toy? People take the valuable things, you know. Yeah. Only you take butt plugs. <laughs> the children's leaving that shit. Yeah, there's gonna be a weird guy, a weird Paul guy who's gonna come collect this, so just leave it out for him. He runs this eBay channel and... Just <laughs> and then you just go over and you're like, oh, okay. What, you have a jeweler's loop and then you just look through the... Oh, it's from the 20s, okay. I can still see traces of fecal matter on this. <laughs> Paul, how you meet Jessica? On, on Yelp. On Yelp? <laughs> Yup, it's not dating app. Did you review a prostitution agency or something? On Yelp. You got five stars. Nice, nice. 
uh, give me the contact detail later. Give me the contact detail later. On Yelp. Okay, explain how you meet her on Yelp. This LA crazy place. Crazy place. I kept seeing her picture and her reviews at places that I go. You keep seeing her. Oh, she reviewed things on Yelp and then you just start following her. Yeah. That very creepy. Paul, oh, that very creepy. I the bagel store hoping I was going to her. You keep going to the bagel store. Hope you're going to run. Don't encourage this creepy behavior. What is this? Oh, shit. If someone do that to Uncle Roger, I'm going to get creeped out. So you just show up at bagel store and you go like, Hey Jessica, <laughs> I've been reading your review lately and I know where you go every Monday to Friday. <laughs> so he knew, what kind of bagel I like. he knew what kind of bagel you like. This is like some serial killer shit. <laughs> this is like a start of true crime documentary. <laughs> Netflix is here, they're gonna make a documentary about you. They're gonna cut to an interview because Jessica will be dead and then you steal her shit. They're gonna interview Jessica parent. And they're gonna go, I knew something was not right. And he kept showing up at these random bagel shops Jessica goes to. Okay, and Jessica, you fell for that shit? I like it. You like it? How desperate are you? This fucked up couple in front row. Are you with them? Are you with them? No. No, stay away. Go sit there. Go, go sit there. But I'm accidentally a filmmaker, so... You're a I'm filmmaker? Yeah, I'm going to make a documentary. Okay, good, good, good. When I die, she'll do a documentary. Okay, when you die, is she gonna do documentary? And he gonna steal your MSG. <laughs> that what gonna happen. So when you meet Jessica at the bagel shop, what you say to her? Did you order for her and then just wait? No, no, I, didn't actually, I never actually met her there. We started uh, talking direct DM. You uh, DM? Yelp. You can DM on Yelp? <laughs> <laughs> Who slide into people's Yelp DM? <laughs> Is it possible? DM on Yelp? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Fuyo. <laughs> so smooth, this nephew. So smooth. Okay. okay, what you say in the DM on Yelp? Uh, that I like her reviews. You like her review? <laughs> okay, okay. And then what, yeah, what you say back? Uh, you have great taste. You have great taste. Yeah. Okay, so what you say back to her? You got great tits. <laughs> what? I mean, it was nine years ago, so I don't remember. It was nine right. years ago. Fui you. Give it up for them. Give it up for them. Do you ever review Paul? <laughs> On Yelp or something? Maybe not for the children. <laughs> Just say, tell us. How many stars? How many stars? Five stars. Five stars! Okay. Very nice. Okay. He's got the umami dick. He's got the umami dick. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, so you dip it in MSG before you. Wow. And then you brought it to me and tried to feed it. Ew. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Oh, it won't fit, huh? For you, it won't fit. <laughs> Sorry, children. Sorry, children. <laughs> you guys, I need you to come with me after every show, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you gotta do that? Yeah. Uh, I, kinda, no, I kinda regret asking that now, so. <laughs> gotta use the same stalking techniques on me. <laughs> I know your favorite bagel. My favorite bagel. I like the everything, you know? It's good. Cream cheese. Why do people get anything else? Yeah. You get everything, right? Yeah, it's the b best value for money. Yeah, every, all the shits on there. What other bagel is there? Plain. Ugh. What are, what are you poor? Plain. <laughs> Any single people here? Single people. Okay. Go try Yelp. Go try Yelp DM. Go try Yelp DM. You both single. You both raise your hand. Yeah. You guys not together. That's my mom. That your mom? <laughs> you sure? You look so young. You 43. Fui yo. Good skincare. Good skincare. He looks so shit. <laughs> you look like you dating. Because of the age. How old are you? 21. 
21, you look like that. Hi. <laughs> 21, nice single still. Yep. And your the mom, you single also? No. Okay. Then why you raise your hand? <laughs> you try to pimp him out, is it? <laughs> try to pimp him. Okay. Has he had girlfriend before? No. 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 Not, that I know. Not that you know of. What kind of woman you like? It's okay to be virgin. It's okay. <laughs> Uncle Roger been virgin before. It's okay. Hey, what kind of woman you like? Uh, Asian woman. Asian woman. <laughs> that very creepy. <laughs> don't, say, don't say the race as the first thing. <laughs> Just say kind and honest. Okay, are you Asian also? No. No? If you're not Asian, definitely don't say <laughs> what Asian woman. That very big fetish, okay? <laughs> By the way, anyone here, any vegetarian niece and nephew? Woo! Hiya! <laughs> of course it would be you! <laughs> you come to the wrong show, Paul, wrong show. It's okay, we accept people with mental illness at the show. We, <laughs> all, we accept them. Uh, is, it, is his food good? Is his food good? Is it, is it good? No, we didn't eat it. You didn't eat it? No, we didn't, we didn't order it. You didn't order it. Oh, okay. I hate cauliflower. You hate cauliflower. Oh, is, are those cauliflower wings? Yeah. Oh. Oh yeah, vegetarian. That's your own fucking fault then. <laughs> you know. <laughs> cauliflower sucks. Yeah. yeah. And vegetarians deserve cauliflower, you know? <laughs> and then they try to make it look like chicken wings. Oh, yeah. This is the saddest thing to get a vegetable to pretend it's chicken. That is so depressing. Are you, are you drinking anything, 21 year old? Yeah. I drink tequila. You drink tequila. Oh, okay. Okay. So I collect tequila. I have at home like 300 bottles of tequila. You have 300 bottles of tequila at home. Wow. Yeah, when you die, Paul's gonna come over. <laughs> just rummage that shit. <laughs> Store your butt plugs away though, yeah, you know? <laughs> Have you gotten drunk in front of your mom before? No. No? Okay. She's been drunk in front of me. You've been drunk in front of him? Many a time. Many, plenty of times. <laughs> you guys got problems in this family, man. Well, I still have kids, so you know, now he can drive me home. Oh, now he can drive you home. Wow, smart, smart. I like it. <laughs>